welcome back to my channel and today I wanted to share with you guys some amazing mascaras that Sigma Beauty came out with. It's called their new Structural Lash Mascara, you guys, and there are three of them. Now we all know Sigma Beauty is most known for their fabulous brushes and of course I guess almost all of you own at least one or two brushes from them. So I was really excited that they actually came out with some mascaras and I love these mascaras, you guys. These are really, really good and they're basically on par with all of the mascaras that we currently use now. They have an inf infallible formula basically that's supposed to work across the board with all of them and the formula stays consistent throughout. It's really, really amazing, you guys. So I'm going to go through each and every single one of these mascaras so you guys can get a close-up of how they look, how they work. Um, each one of them has a different thing that they do. So let me first start off with sharing with you the names of the mascaras. They are called... The first one is the High Caliber, we have the Sinuosity Lash, and we also have the Monumental Lash. So the structural lashes from Sigma Beauty, basically what these mascaras are supposed to do is to give a structure to your lashes, if that makes sense. Like whatever type of structure you want for your lashes, that's exactly what happens. So if you want length, then you can build on length using the high caliber lash. If you're looking for a curl, then you go for the sinuosity lash. If you're looking for volume, then you go with the monumental lash. Like there's so many options and it's one formula, but three different brushes. So you basically get the best of one formula, but the best of three different lashes. So I'm just going to go ahead and share with you some information about each and every single one of these lashes and how they worked on my lashes. Now my lashes are basically, they're long but they're not thick and they're slightly curled on their own but I have a lot of lashes you guys so I had super high hopes for these and they did not disappoint. So yeah, again, I'm going to go ahead and share with you the first one. Now let's talk about the Sinuosity Mascara. Now the Sinuosity Mascara is basically the mascara that you're going to want if you want a curl to your lash. So if your lashes are straight down sideways that way pointing straight up. If you want a nice curl to your lash, then the Sinuosity Mascara is the right for you. Now, what's so special about it is the actual wand. Now, the wand is physically curled. Like, you can see, if you if I hold it up, it's actually curled, you guys. So, it's curled and it also has those little fine teeth combs on it. So, it's like a, like a molded plastic in sort of way in terms of how it's curved and then the teeth on it are not bristles, they're like the little plastic teeth that grip and basically curl your lash at the same time. So when they curl the lash, they lift and separate it. So that is what the Sinuosity Lash is all about. <laughs> also boasts that the formula for the structural lashes mascaras are basically smudge resistant, water resistant, uh, they have 13 hour wear and I probably wouldn't wear my mascara for 13 hours but it claims that but I noticed that it doesn't budge throughout the day so that's always good and it's also paraben free so if you're not into parabens then these mascaras are great for you. Now moving on to monumental lash. The monumental lash mascara this one is basically for those who want volume so with this one the wand is a whole lot thicker like it's thick you guys like it's almost half the size of my pinky finger that's how thick this wand is but it also has some dips and curves to it so basically what happens is since the wand is thicker it grabs a little bit more product than uh, sinuosity would grab and basically it it has the the bristle type of what do you call that? The hairs on it are like the bristle type. So it's like a brush and it literally brushes your curls and leaves a little bit more product at the base of the lash. So you get a whole lot more volume than you would with say the Sinuosity since the Sinuosity is more about curling it. So the Monumental Lash is for those who want that thick, voluminous look to their lashes without looking clumpy. Now with this one, I would say when you're hitting your second going on third, coat of this it starts to clump up a little bit but nothing too serious you know but yeah this is actually really really good for volumizing to the point where I wore this one and my boyfriend was like 
your eyes look lashy today. I'm like, what do you mean they look lashy? He's like, you wearing false lashes? I said, no. And he was like, well, what are you wearing? I was like, it's just the mascara, the monumental mascara from Single Beauty. And he was like, that looks good. Keep wearing that because I couldn't tell. And honey, if your man can't tell, then that's awesome. So you need this one. If you're really looking for volume and you really want your, you know, your significant other to notice that your lashes are on fleek, then you need this one. that I want to talk about from Sigma Beauty. This one is the High Caliber Mascara. So the High Caliber Mascara is basically for those who want length. If you have curl lashes already or you don't need volume and you have a lot but your lashes are short and stubby and you want some length then the High Caliber Mascara is the mascara for you. Now what I noticed about the wand for the High Caliber Mascara is that it's long and it's straight. It does have like a small bump at the front, but it's basically straight and the bristles on it, like the brush hairs on it, are actually short. So what they do is they basically grip the lash, or the, the however much lash you have, and they pull it out. So it pulls it out and it has the bristles really, really, really compact and dense together, so it drops a lot of product. So once it drops the product, grips your lash, and you curl up, it pulls the lash up. This curls a little bit, but not too much, so it's gonna really lengthen the lash and not clump up on you at all. for a little bit the box that it comes in is a really nice and sleek and the letters in it or the name of the actual lash is on there and it's like holographic and that's really really cool um the actual tubes that they come in are sleek and black as you can see here now the only thing that i have an issue with in terms of the packaging on here is if you're a grease head like me or you know you know has a lot of oils and stuff then eventually the actual name on there is gonna rub off as you can see my Sigma that's how long I've been using this how much I've been using it um, actually started to rub off the other ones are okay for now I'll show a comparison here as you can see this one's rubbing off and the other one is still there so I think they have to probably figure something else out in terms of how they put the name of what it is on there. I mean, the name is actually at the bottom too, on little stickers on the bottom there, but still, like, I love how the name of the mascara is on there and Sigma's logo, but if you want staying power, then that's gonna have to change. So they're gonna have to do a little bit of tweaking with how they package these in terms of the name on the actual tube of the mascara. Okay you guys, so now that you've seen all three of the Sigma Beauty Structural Lashes mascaras like in action on my lashes, let me know down in the comment section which one is your favorite. I'm gonna put a link down in the description bar so you guys can get directed straightly to them. Um, they do sell these separately and they also sell them in a set. So if you're interested in trying all three, I'm gonna post the set link down in the description bar as well so you guys can go ahead and check those out. And when you buy them together in the set, you can mix and match and find your favorite combination out of the three or just use them alone or you know mix high caliber with monumental and all that other stuff so I think the set is the best way to go the set is $45 and like I said it's cheaper than buying them on their own they're $19 a piece on their own um, so obviously that's cheaper and as always Sigma has coupon goes I'm gonna put one down in the description bar so you guys can save some coin hello okay so yeah I'm in love with these new Sigma mascaras you guys 
I I think Sigma hit the ball out of the park with these mascaras. The packaging is really lightweight. The formula is really lightweight on the lashes. It doesn't end up everywhere except for my um, eye makeup. Now it is a little bit messy when it comes to putting it on. You have your eye makeup on, so just be aware aware of that. That it's not that thick, heavy formula that sticks to the lash and doesn't move. No. It's gonna get on your makeup a little bit, so just be mindful of that. So I am completely and totally obsessed with these mascaras. All three of them are really good, but my favorite is the monumental one and that's because it gives me real volume and makes me look lashy like my boyfriend says all right you guys so don't forget to thumbs up this video if it was helpful to you and go ahead and subscribe if you have not already and i will talk to you guys in another video really really soon bye guys